Hello, sports fans, sports betters, YouTube Nation. John here with Rick and Picks. Hope everybody's having a great and happy Thursday. Um, I got to start this video by saying happy anniversary to my wife. Um, five year anniversary now. I have the little one that we added. So um, I'll be leaving work early today to go spend time with her and then coming in a little bit later tomorrow. So um, maybe if I get time tonight, I'll make a video for tomorrow. If not, my video tomorrow will be late or I just won't have one. I haven't decided yet. But. Um, Right now, this video is super late. I had a bunch of paperwork, unexpected paperwork this morning. And, um, you know, business comes first, especially when you're buying it. But um, yesterday, I had two winners. One went off early, early, early this morning. But it was on yesterday's card. That was Yokohama F. Marinos in the Japan soccer. Uh, another winner in Japan soccer. And then my chart pick, the St. Louis Cardinals won. Free YouTube play was the Mariners' first five uh, run line. <sighs> They cannot deal with Texas. They made Spencer Howard look like he was a Cy Young Award winning pitcher last night. Spencer Howard's not a Cy Young Award winning pitcher. But Mike Falkenwitz is going against the Mariners tonight and expect him to look like Cy Young for the first five innings also. Um, Mariners just don't hit poor pitching very well. It's like they take the night off or something. They ended up winning the game 2-1, to one, but it took a while for them to get there. Phillies, Orioles... Reds had them all first five money line. All three did not hit. And then I had the Rays on the money line. And last I looked, it was 20 to 1. I stopped looking after that. But Boston absolutely crushed them. So, um, you know, fun for Boston. They, they were like, hey, you know, we got a lot of pent-up frustration. Tampa Bay's been killing us all year. And then they just unleashed the Dragons on them. Sticking to Major League Baseball today, um, games have already started. Um, I jumped on all th um I didn't jump on the, the Mets-Washington game. That started way early. But the other three games I did jump on, I had no score first inning um, with the uh, Phillies and Dodgers. And Bryce Harper hit a home run with two outs in the bottom of the first to crush that. But uh, the other games, I got St. Louis on the money line and Oakland on the money line. So we'll see how those go. Both teams are up right now. But uh, that doesn't mean nothing. For your free YouTube play, we're going um, out to Arizona. we got the uh, Diamondbacks, Padres, you um, Darvish. Um, against Weidner, part two. Uh, these two pitchers have recently matched up against each other. Um, they went toe to toe on August seventh. Um, six to two was the verdict of that game. Padres won. Uh, Darvish ended up going um, seven innings in that game, gave up two earned runs. Weidner in that game went five innings. He gave up two earned runs. So we could see another uh, pitchers duel again, if you will. The line for this game is, is crazy to me. Um, obviously, the Padres, they're a heavily publicly backed team. And, you know, the betting surface shows that. The first five in this game, the money line is minus 220. The run line is minus 145. And then if you look at the game, it's minus 228 for the Padres, plus 206 for the Diamondbacks. Um, but I'm going to take the Padres on the run line here. I think they're going to get the job done again. Um, I think Darvish keeps him in the game. I think Weidner's going to stick the Diamondbacks around for a little bit. But I think by the end of the day, or end of the game, the Padres are just going to take over and beat up that Arizona bullpen as they have done you know, quite regularly this season. Diamondbacks do play a little better at home. Um, so that is, you know, a underlying factor. But they're just on the season as a whole, they're 35 and 80. They're going nowhere. They're going nowhere fast. Um, they've lost Wiener's last three starts. Um, Darvish kind of turned things around in his last couple starts. So I'm going to roll with Darvish here. I think she get, he gets the job done. I think the first five run line will cash at minus 145. I just like the, the whole game run line. So your official Ricketts pop pick for this game is going to be the San Diego Padres on the run line for the full game at minus 143. I'm going to put a half a unit on it. That's how we're going to roll. If you guys have not already, if you're new, hit the subscribe button. Give me a big old thumbs up if you appreciate true free daily sports betting advice each and every single day right here on this YouTube channel. Um, don't forget to hit the like button. That helps my Google Analytics for me. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know who you're on. Let me know what you got going on. And then, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you very much for watching this video. And most importantly, good luck with your bets.